What's going on world? It's your boy Big Chips here with CreatingSimpleFreedom.com and today we're going to start into our series of just marketing training videos just to help you be prepared and to get you where you need to be going in order to make money online. Uh, a lot of people will just kind of throw you at, I'd say wolves, but will throw you at the wolves so to speak and you just gotta get in that pen with these ferocious animals and you're like what do I do now so that's what we're gonna be doing over this series of a few weeks months years whatever however long it takes us to do uh, because I want to I want to go from beginner into advanced and in between throw in stuff that maybe you're struggling with or things you would like to see uh, me talk about or train on so a couple of the questions that we will actually start with are people just not understanding what marketing is and why it's important. And we're in network marketing, no matter what you what you want to call it. You know, whether it's affiliate, whether it's inter, you know, you're doing online, offline, MLM, affiliate marketing, whatever these niches that you're in, but it's all network marketing. And it's all work from home. It's all building on internet or offline, off word of mouth, off talking, advertising, all this stuff. And it's like a when you get down to it, but it's really not that hard. So what we're going to talk about a little bit is what is marketing? Marketing is basically just communicating the value of a product or service to a customer in order to sell that said product or service you know basically in layman terms you're allocating resources your time and your money in order to achieve an objective which will be profit okay so it's really really not that hard I, it, churching it up and you know, putting it in these terms and all that stuff can make it confusing but it's really really simple you're just trying to take whatever it is you're selling, whatever it is that you're offering to the customer, to the consumer, to someone who wants to join your business, you're offering them a, a something. Okay, so right now, this is a really, really good pen. I love this pen, and I want you to love it too, so I'm going to sell you this pen for a dollar. Do you want it? Yes, Big Chips, I want your pen. Oh, well, thank you for answering. Transaction is, marketing is, I'm telling you about this pen. I'm telling you why it's good. I'm using all the avenues around me from social media, from blogging, from CPC, PPC, PPV, all these advertising things. Online, offline, it's interchangeable. We're going around the circle so that everyone possible that comes around me will know that I have this special pin for a dollar. That is marketing. You are just getting the product out there in front of people and you are trying to sell that product to make a profit. You know, but really when it comes down to it, marketing, you're looking into what they call the marketing mix, all right? And they call it the four P's, which are product, place, promotion, and price. These are all four things that you have to focus on in your marketing on to getting your information out there. But your boy Big Chips likes to add that fifth one in, that's the special one, and that's the one that makes and breaks every single deal, and that's the people, right? So in your marketing, you have your product. That is your solution. That is the thing that you're trying to get to the people. You have uh, the place, you have the access. Is it a store? Is it online or is it offline? Can, you know, where do they go to get said product? You have the promotion. That's the information you're giving out to the, to the realm, to the people to sell that product. Then you have the price and that's your value. So when you mix all those together, you get that, that fifth and final one and that's people. That's the longevity of your brand. All right, that's how you extend your marketing, extend your place of business, and take yourself to that next level. So, things that you think need to think about, let's see, in, in your product is, what, what does the customer need? So, you think about this product that you have, 
and how is this product going to help them or aid them in some in, in a problem you know when you're thinking about how to how to market somebody you're thinking outside the box you're thinking of what is their pain like where is this person really hurting and how can I solve this hurt with my product because you're 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 basically you're you're a doctor you're trying to heal the hurt all right so you think about that what features do you have uh, how will they use it you're thinking about all this into your marketing pieces into how you're gonna pitch the product now I will make a blog post about this and I'm gonna put all the questions that I've ever written down I've got a list of them here that I could probably read off if you want me to but it's it's very simple here we'll read a few of them off you got product okay how and where will the customer use it what does it look like how will the customer experience it what size colors should it be what's it called how's it branded what is the most it can cost to provide the value that it gives you know, you're thinking about all these things when you're thinking about your product the place you know is like I said what's the distribution channels that you're gonna use are you online are you offline are you doing social media are you blogging are you doing things like Google AdWords Facebook PPC you know how are you marketing is it going to be video based whatever the case may be there's just all these things that you can learn from all of this but the key is remembering you are taking what you have here and all these little things these the, it's called again the marketing mix it's the four P's big chips likes to call it the five P's because I think people your brand is nothing without the that fifth one so you got to keep that in mind when you're doing these things is remember who is your avatar who is that perfect person but you know understand marketing is the process of communicating the value of your product of your services to the customer or the purpose of selling that product or that service to that customer okay so just keep that in mind uh, questions that I get is why is marketing important you know everybody's like well warm market cold market all these things but it's all still marketing and that and I think I'll do like a separated video on like the whole social marketing thing of you know be marketing everywhere you go be marketing everywhere you go because why is that important because it's always important to carry your brand wherever you go you know so if you're at a Walmart if you're at a at a convenience store if you're at a kids soccer game and it just happens that somebody sparks that and they're like yo man this Red Bull man's got me jacked up but man I hate the crash well here let me let me introduce you to the Thunderbolt let me show you an all-natural energy drink 10 calories no sugar no crashes all right our energy comes from the green tea fleet uh, green tea leaf <laughs> so I mean it's things like that always be marketing and again marketing is just getting your information the process all of it out to the masses of the world you know you're making a plan and you know I think is uh, Benjamin Franklin is the one that really said it but if you fail to plan then you plan to fail so why do most people fail in network marketing it's because they never even made a plan to begin with they jump in it just ad hoc and they're all oh, let's do it but they don't even understand what marketing is so all these videos all this content all this everything that's out there if you do not know what marketing is you're never gonna do it the right way and you're you're just gonna be going around in a circle and it doesn't matter how great the training is it doesn't matter how great the product is the program is if you don't understand marketing marketing 101 if you do not understand the four P's of the marketing mix if you don't understand that fifth one I've add on, added on then the people then you're missing the boat and the whole whole thing's lost so why is marketing important well you're getting your brand out there all right so when you market you're studying these the marketing mix 
all right and let's uh, again you got your product all right you've got the place you've got the promotion you've got the price and you've got the people and this is where this come this fifth one comes into play right because you got to focus on all these things so you know what you're talking about you know what you're going after because your people are your avatar that's your perfect person who is it that you want on your team who is it that you want to buy this product who is it that you want to use this all natural energy drink okay it's it's these little things like that that really truly help you to define what you're doing in order to make a plan and that's what we're going to be working on in the next couple of days too and uh, next in upcoming weeks because i really want this to be an adventure all right i have walked away from doing these trainings because i don't know i just i thought i could just leverage my time doing something else or leverage my time using somebody else and i want my I keep hearing the same thing I don't understand how to do this this is what I learned but I don't understand why we should do it I don't understand why we should do that this is what I thrive on okay just so you know <laughs> this is what I thrive on I love the opportunity to be able to help somebody I love the opportunity to share what I know I have lived with the motto of learn teach and do for many years now and I've taught this to just handfuls of marketers that are out there and I've helped them become successful and the problem of it is a lot of this stuff I did behind closed doors off camera or off recording live to the public and I think that's a disservice to everyone in this industry because we have a lot of just horrible horrible marketers out there all right we have people that are out there preaching how great they are but they have no integrity all right they're selling you something that they themselves are not using or they're promising you a lifestyle that they themselves are not living I'm here to be real I'm here to keep it 100 you know what I'm saying this is this is me this is how I do some will like it some won't so what all right my main goal is to help you be a better person I want to be your friend and I want to help you excel to that next level, but as my wife says, I'm a bit of a hard ass, all right? I want you to understand that there is more to this than just making money or just turning and burning, all right? It's about a longevity, it's about a career, it's about the long haul, not the short road. So keep these this in mind as we go along. The things I talk about, the things that I do, may mention my products, okay? Like I just talked about my Thunderbolt. So that will happen because it's what I do. It's what I have. You can replace Thunderbolt with your waterless pans. If you're still doing that with your Amway, with your blogging platform, whatever, that, whatever it is that you're selling, replace product with product, okay? This is mainly for my team, but I'm going to share this with the public because I think the public can get some really, really great value out of what I'm talking about. All right, so we want to think about our, our product. We want to think about the place, where it's going, where you're getting it, the promotion thereof, the price, the people, and make a plan for our marketing campaign, which would be anything. And now, Let's think about why is marketing important? I'm sure I'm going to say this, and especially if you're in America, <laughs> you're going to hear this and you're going to think of somebody right off the top of your head. All right. You're watching TV. There's a commercial. Have you been injured in a car accident or have you been injured at work? Somewhere, someplace, you know of an attorney who does personal injury they have a little jingle we have Joel Bieber call Joel Bieber today you know we have it, it's ingrained because the marketing is to put that on during the daytime run it hardcore during the day when they know injured people will be home watching TV because they can't go to work 
right in between soap operas you know especially but you know they have their marketing campaign of when is the prime time for me to show you this video to maximize that that thing so when you're doing your marketing think about these personal injury attorneys think about how they're out there with their their marketing mix how they put it out there the jingle the way they approach it all of these things and uh, my buddy Mark put out a video because the new Derek Jeter Gatorade commercial was a very perfect case in point of marketing slash advertising they they shot the video of Derek Jeter it was black and white the stage was New York inside of the field I mean Yankee Stadium and I mean it was just it was classic it brought you back into a moment whether you live there or not or whether you even like baseball it set you back into this time into this feeling of what they were trying to recreate so think about that in your marketing when you watch something on TV when you hear something on the radio, when you read an ad that's popping up on Facebook, look at it. Look at what they're trying to do. Try to discover what the product is. Try to discover, you know, where the place is to buy. Well, it's kind of, you know, it's obvious, but think about the promotion of how they're doing it. Get, you know, and start learning how people are marketing. And that's how you learn. That's how I got to do everything that I'm doing. That's how I was able to climb the ranks that I've climbed because I studied what people were doing. And I watched and I listened, but I heard. I heard what they were saying. I heard what they were doing. I visualized myself doing that same thing. And that's why it's important to surround yourself with knowledge. Knowledge is the new money. Alright, it is. Knowledge is power, but useless if you do not apply what you learn. Alright, so think about these things and think about that avatar. You know, I'll go further into this. If there's anything in this video that you sit back and say, man, I wish you would talk about that, shoot me a message. Look me up on Facebook at Mr. Big Chips. Alright, if we're friends on Facebook, then you know how to get a hold of me. Alright. So I'll, hell, I'll put my number in the, in the description below if you want to call me. I don't even care. I'm here to help people grow. And I want this industry to be successful. I want this industry to get out of this bad name, bad taste in your mouth, bullcrap mentality scam artist with no integrity that it is. And bring it back to what it, what it really is. Because all this negative bad stuff, it clouds what network marketing is. We are a $169 billion industry. Alright, we do some business. There is so much money being made in this industry. We've made more six-figure earners than any other industry. This is an unbelievable opportunity. It is a very legal opportunity. And it can be very prosperous if you do it correctly all right so like I said this is just one of many video trainings this is not a little video I understand that these are going to be trainings on how to do things how to do something so when you've got a question when you've got a concern something you're hitting a roadblock on I don't care if it's a graphic if you want to learn how to use Photoshop, let me know. I'll do some tutorials on using Photoshop in marketing world. If it's uh, how to how to blog, how to set up a blog, how what's a good template to use, what is whatever, we'll do that. Uh, you know, marketing in general. You know, it does not matter if it's just a struggle. Like I tried this and it didn't work. Let's shoot a video about it, right? You know, let's get on a Hangout Live, we'll fix it live, or we'll do it live, and let other people see and visualize with us. So it can be a learning experience for all those involved. And it doesn't matter if you're on my team, it doesn't matter if you're in my company. None of that matters because marketing is marketing. Alright? 
just replace one product with the next and you're done and it really is that easy so that's where we're going that's what we're going to be talking about over the coming days let me see if i missed anything i got a little checklist here that i want to make sure i talk about but uh yeah man just remember anytime you can talk about your business anytime that you can brand yourself out there in the marketplace do it just do it with with class do it with purpose everything that you do should be on purpose and with purpose you feel me you know always stay 100 don't don't waver don't let other people try to dissect you it happens it's it's a dirty industry but it's it's very fun it's very lucrative and i've met some of some of the best friends i've ever had online and it's just a beautiful beautiful thing so until the next video it's your boy big chips here with creating simplefreedom.com stay classy and make it a great day i dare you